In this video, we're going to take a look at uh, how to maximize, minimize, and resize a file folder. So I have my file folder over here that I'll be working on. Um, all I'm going to do is go ahead and to open it, just uh, double click on it with the left click button. And notice it'll open up. This particular file happens to be empty. As it indicates right here, there are no folders in this file. If I wanted to minimize this, it's really the same as the old operating system. I'm going to go ahead and click this bar right here, and that'll minimize it. Now notice when I minimize, it's going to take it down to right here. Okay. And when I hover over it, and this is kind of a neat feature of Windows 7, it's going to give me kind of a preview of what that item is. In this case, it's indicating the um, name of the folder. I can go ahead and hover over it and it will bring it up by default kind of give me a preview if we had several folders open I could scroll over the the different folders and it would bring them up as I hovered over them in this case we want to go ahead and select this one so I'll do so by clicking on it so again to minimize right here hover over your Windows Explorer click on the folder and that will maximize it okay to resize I'm going to click on the middle tab right here and notice it'll drop it down to a smaller size. To further resize it, all I have to do is hover over the border, left click on the border and resize to my liking. I can come down here to the corner and do the same. If I want to bring it back to its full screen view, I just click on that again. And to close the folder, as always, I click the red X. And this has been how to minimize, maximize, and resize a file using Windows 7.